Well, 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 I'm back. Hey everybody, this is Chris Steele at Steel Frags, and tonight we are reviewing Latafa's Hayati Al-Maleki in the blue bottle. This is going to be a hell of a review, just to let you know. This thing is uh, beautiful. I haven't been here in a while, so I might be a little rusty on my review. So don't roast me in the comments. Um, there's just a lot of stuff that's been going on in my personal life, I'm trying to get some things in order. But as of now, fingers crossed, your boy is good. Um, first and foremost, I just want to thank everybody. We have broken the 300 mark on subscribers. So give yourselves a round of applause. Thank you for helping a brother out and even more so helping yourself out by helping me help you make the world a better smelling place. I still got it. I still got it just a little bit. But anyway, so tonight we're reviewing this fragrance, Hayati Al-Maleki. Um, let's get into the uh, notes. Well, first I wanna say, I wanna preface it before we get into the notes and everything. Uh, this is a clone of Paco Rabanne Phantom. And I have smelled Phantom, I had a sample of Phantom. When I say, man, this this fragrance gets close, it's it's about as close as your step uncle at a cookout. I mean, it's it's close. It's very close. Um, so take that how you will. It's just jokes. Anyway, um, yeah, this comes very close to uh, Paco Rabanne's Phantom. It is a. Uh, Absolutely delicious. I have gotten some great compliments from this fragrance. So it's about 20 bucks right now. So I'm just saying. Anyway, let's get into the notes. We got nutmeg, pink pepper, bergamot, and ginger in the top. We have cedarwood, woody notes, labdenum, and incense in the middle. And in the base, we have musk, ambergris, and amber. Those are the notes. I don't know if I smell all that, but I know what I do smell. I smell good. I smell real good. I'm about to prove it. About to light this bad boy up. You know what I see? About to light it up. Oh my goodness. This is a banger. Now, I don't agree with, uh, well, I can kind of see the top. Because it says pink pepper, bergamot, and ginger. The bergamot and ginger are definitely there. I can kind of smell the pink pepper now. So yeah, they're they're right. They're right. I'm just I'm tweakified right now. You know what I'm saying? Just a little tweaked out. But um, yes, phantom, phantom, especially on the dry down. The opening, the difference between phantom and this on the opening is phantom is not as citrus uh, forward. It goes more with the pink pepper, so it's a little more spicy. This one's a little more citrusy, but honestly, I like this one better for that reason. I, I do like spice, but generally I like um, I like spices in my food, not in my fragrances. I do enjoy a spicy fragrance every now and then, but after a while, just you start having allergies and sneezing. I don't want to be mistaken for like a roast beef sandwich or something like that. Anyway, let's get into it. This smells great. So we got we got our notes, got our fragrance on skin. Let me tell you a little bit about some of the compliments that I got from wearing this fragrance. Uh, for one, I, I recently was visiting a buddy and he had a, a, a girlfriend that I had never met before in my life. And um, it was so funny. I come in the door and I'm wearing that. And, you know, we're getting ready to sit down and watch watch some wrestling. You know, I'm sham. I was watching, uh, what was that? Money in, the Money in the Bank. Uh, that was like a week or two ago or something like that. But anyway, um, we're, watch, we're getting ready to watch the event. She's in the kitchen, you know, making some sliders. And she comes in the living room and she says, hey. She's talking to, to my buddy, Craig. She says, hey, Craig, did you spray something? Did you did you spray something? Something smells really, really good. And Craig just goes like this. He goes, and he points at me. And of course, I'm just like, 
So yeah, that, that was like one of those kinds of compliments. Um, also I had another compliment. I was, um, with my wife and she was doing her physical therapy and, um, I I'm like sitting down in the waiting room with this on and one of the female physical therapists comes into a, a, like, she would always smile when she saw me, you know, but I'm used to that. I'm used to, you know, people smiling when they see me, uh, women, especially no, but, um, in all seriousness, uh, she comes in the, in the waiting room right? She, she was like walking towards where the physical therapy was. And then she like turns around, comes back in the waiting room and she's like, um, excuse me. And I'm like, yes. And she's like, you know, every time, uh, what she says, she says, every time you come in here, I can smell your cologne and it smells so good. It smells so good. And I'm just like, Oh, thank you. Thank you. You know, that's what I do. That's about my only talent in um, this universe or this this life, at least, is that I can smell good. And look, I look somewhat, you know, attractive. Those are my two biggest accomplishments, you know. So I just, just so everybody knows, that's that's my whole, that's my gift. I smell good and I look good. No, but she, she was really nice and she told me how good I smelled and I appreciate it. So... That's a big thing, man. Compliment factor, especially with it being summertime. And I will say, I know I'm jumping all over the place. This isn't like my other videos where it's kind of streamlined and everything's lined up nicely. I will get to that. So let's get to it. Seasons. Spring, summer, fall. Boom. Uh, you can wear this on a summer day. I go heavy. So that should let you know you're safe to wear this for summer. Just maybe not on the hottest day in existence. Do not, you know, be walking around and it's 128 degrees and you got this on. Probably won't be walking very far, but you're going to leave a, a really, really crazy scent trail. Nah, it's bullshit. Anyway, um, can wear it pretty much spring, summer, fall, uh, winter. I got better stuff for that. Anyway, moving on. So uh, projection. This is a, a projection beast. Yes, it is a beast. It is a room filler. It is a... The entire block knows you are living in this apartment. Um, it is not no game. You could probably smell me just a little bit right now through your, through your mobile device or your computer. It is that strong. Monster projector... Um, as far as uh, sillage, beautiful sillage, uh, when you move, you know what I'm saying, you get to moving, you smell good. You smell good. So uh, longevity, now this is the, the big one for everyone, longevity. Um, Performance-wise, I would say this is pretty solid. This is actually pretty close to the performance on Phantom, maybe even better, because I got about seven or eight hours out of it solid if you wear if you spray this on your clothes it'll last you a good nine ten hours so spray your clothes don't be afraid to spray your clothes pro tip spray your clothing and spray the back of your neck too that's another big one you gotta spray the back of your neck because that lets all the people behind you let you know you're there all right so uh seasons performance occasions what kind of occasion would you wear this well as i just kind of admitted to i'll wear this anywhere anytime any day any place um you can wear this casually you can dress this up i would say it is more it leans more casual though because while it is somewhat uh it does for some reason in Fragranska, they say it's, it's lavender heavy. And I've heard other reviewers, you know, um, state that this is a lather, lather, lavender. Sorry, that was really hard to say for some reason. That this is a lavender heavy um, fragrance. I don't really get lavender at all. What I get is mainly that ginger, uh, amber, like ginger amber what else is in there woody incense kind of smell with some bergamot 
and, and slight pepper. That's what I get. I don't get lavender at all. But I will tell you, it does smell really good. So don't be afraid to spray this on. It is a great pickup. Currently, it is on Amazon, which is probably one of my favorite stores. I have an unhealthy obsession with Amazon because they deliver your goods within like a day or two. And me, I have no patience. I will not pretend like I have patience. Um, I'm like a bad doctor. I have no patience, none at all. Um, so you can get this within a day for about 20 bucks on Amazon. No frills, just chills. Hayati Al Maleki. Smells very good. Anyway, I've held you guys enough. If you like what I've shown, please remember, subscribe, hit the like button, be active in the comments. Your boy will be making a strong comeback into the fragrance channel. It is not over. It is just beginning. Uh, we're, we're not being delayed or we're not being, see, I messed it up. It was going to sound really cool too. Damn it. Let me see if I can salvage it. We are not being denied. We are being delayed. Boom. Got it. All right. Everybody applause. Anyway, no, you guys know what it is. <clears throat> Until next time. Peace.